Good evening. It's Saturday, March the 6th. Let the name of the Lord be blessed from this time forth forevermore. From the rising of the sun to its going down, let the name of the Lord be praised. Let my cry come before you, O Lord. Give me understanding according to your word. Let my supplication come before you. Deliver me according to your promise. The Lord is in his holy temple. Let all the earth keep silence before him. Weave a story to tell to the nations that shall turn their hearts to right. A story of truth and mercy. A story of peace and light. For the darkness shall turn to dawning and the dawning to noonday bright. And Christ's great kingdom shall come to earth, the kingdom of love and light. We've a song to be sung to the nations that shall lift their hearts to the Lord. A song that shall conquer evil and shatter spear and sword. For the darkness shall turn to dawning and the dawning to noonday bright. And Christ's great kingdom shall come to earth, the kingdom of love and light. We've a savior to show the nations who the path of sorrow has trod, that all of the world's peoples might come to the truth of God, for the darkness shall turn to dawning and the dawning to noonday bright. And Christ's great kingdom shall come to earth, the kingdom of love and light. Turn again to your rest, O my soul, for the Lord has treated you well. You will arise and have compassion on Zion, for it is time to have mercy upon her. Indeed, the appointed time has come. For your servants love her very rubble and are moved to pity even for her dust. The nations shall fear your name, O Lord, and all the kings of the earth your glory. For the Lord will build up Zion and his glory will appear. He will look with favor on the prayers of the homeless. He will not despise their plea. Turn again to your rest, O my soul, for the Lord has treated you well. Keep me, Lord, as the apple of your eye and carry me under the shadow of your wings. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread and forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Most loving Father, whose will it is for us to give thanks for all things, to fear nothing but the loss of you, and to cast all our care on you who cares for us. Preserve me from faithless fears and worldly anxieties, that no clouds of this mortal life may hide from me the light of that love which is immortal, and which you have manifested to us in your Son, Jesus Christ our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Almighty God, who after the creation of the world rested from all your works and sanctified a day of rest for all your creatures, grant that I, putting away all earthly anxieties, may be duly prepared for the service of public worship, and grant as well that my Sabbath upon the earth may be a preparation for the eternal rest promised to your people in heaven through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen.